Hello there. This is Sovereign Sis is otherwise known as Alexander Malinan, but that doesn't matter. What matters is that I'm your teacher and this is a brand new episode of Star Wars School. Now, the school has been closed for a very long time, and this is mostly because of this huge pandemic going around the world, and we've had to organize these online lessons, which is why it took longer than usual uh, to organize them, because you usually are just sitting in the class. Well, you're not actually, you're still online. Let's not break the illusion here. Let's study our next lesson, which is the language that is known as Hatties. Hatties was the hot language, and actually quite a lot of people throughout the galaxy spoke it. Today I, your teacher, am going to teach you several words of the Hatties language, when they are spoken during the movie, and what they mean. Patisa means friend, and is in fact the name of Jabba's rancor. Now that I think about it, that is so cute! Now, I, I am unsure whether this name was thought of by Jabba himself or his major domo Bib Fortuna, who gave the Rancor as a gift. But either way, that's a fantastic name. Name all of your pets like that, students. That is an order. Muli Ra means money. And I'm very familiar with this particular word due to the fantastic song in Galaxy's Edge. <laughs> Jabba says Wurska to his crew in A New Hope after they are about to leave. This translates to Let's go! Tone one, three, two, pie is a phrase Jabba says to Jedi Master Luke Skywalker in Return of the Jedi and translates to There will be no bargain. Sebulba's mean comment to Anakin when he says We now come Panza Pudu <laughs> means now you are Panza Sada. <laughs> when Jabba expresses his like for Solo and Carbonite as a decoration, he says, Solo bull kuba kuchala. This means, I love Captain Solo where he is. The character of Bib Fortuna is probably most famous for Dewanawanga, which is a form of greeting. In The Phantom Menace, the junk dealer Waro both speaks a lot of Hatis and Basic. Here are some examples of his sentences and what they translate to. Assassin Zam Wessel's last words before her unfortunate demise are something many people have been curious of. She criticized her murderer Django, claiming he was a bounty hunter, slime bull. On Cloud City, a prodigal droid terribly insults C-3PO by saying Echuta, which is an awful insult. Thank you for attending this wonderful lesson. I am happy you managed to be here on time, students. See you in the next one.